So for the uh, two food chains in the evergreen coniferous forest, we have two different types. Uh, we have a smaller type and we also have a bigger example. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to jump right into that. So for the first example, we have starting off with the producer level grass, nuts or berries, I drew grass. But these will be consumed by the eastern chipmunk who will with its cheeks store and carry and eat the nuts and berries. It'll store them for the winter, it'll bring them around to share with the family and they'll go ahead and eat it right away. Uh, these little guys, they like to move in little numbers and get things done. And though they will finally be eaten by the red-tailed hawk, the secondary consumer of this level, who have great vision and who can hunt the eastern chipmunk down from the skies with no problems. And over on the second example, Starting at the producer level, we have reindeer lichen. It's a, lich a type of lichen, also kind of like mossy, which will be consumed by the North American caribou. What makes this guy special is that it's one of the only large mammals to be able to eat lichen thanks to a specialized type of bacteria and protozoa that lives in its stomach. And now these guys will finally be eaten by the American black bear. It's a great dish to have, I hear, from the bears, but it's such a hard job obtaining it. The energy that they waste on trying to hunt it down may not always equal the amount of energy they bring in, so you oftentimes find them hunting down elk or deer or smaller game, not quite as big as these guys.